Hey guys, um, Nikki here, and uh, I just wanted to do a video, an HD video, if it focuses, um, of uh, my Paradox Corn Snake because so many people had suggested or wanted another video on her. This is Barry, my um, Snow and Amel Paradox Corn Snake. As you can tell, her whole entire body is very evenly paradoxed, as you may want to call it. Um, she grew a lot within within these couple of months. Um, it's really cool. Let's see if we can focus on a bit. Um, sorry, but my cam I'm using my Canon camera, the big ones, um, to video this, and um, it doesn't exactly focus on the places I want it to but I mean it's a snake so it's okay because um, it's focusing on different areas of the snake um, except for that blurry part right there um, so that you could actually see the whole body of the snake and um, I just wanted to do an HD video because all of you have been asking me to do HD videos uh, and here it is one of them um, as I said reason why I never really did HD videos before is because um, it does take up a lot a lot of space and it does um, take ages to download onto the uh, computer so that is why other than that this is pretty much about it this is Barry um, you can see okay Let's try if we could do this. Okay. Sorry, wobbly. You can see on her body, um, there are the orange and pinks that a normal snow would have, and the orange and reds that an Amel would have as well. Now, if I can move down the body with the focus. Oop. I have no idea what she's doing right there. And she's kind of squirming around. Um, but yep, this is a fully paradox corn snake. Um, there is a morph called, uh, I think reverse stripe, not reverse stripe, something opal. <laughs> Sorry, I got really, I just woke up and I'm really mixed up with the names. Um, it's one of the, uh, I don't think it's new actually, but it's definitely not super common, so. Um, cause we have a new shipment of Tesseras, uh, charcoal Tesseras all kinds of different tesseras um, and uh, one of them I saw they actually have this kind of paradoxy effect on it but you can tell that it's not a paradox because it's very even and uh, you can tell that this snake is a paradox because of all the spots let's see if I could get up onto her head sorry blurry moments you see on her head her head is very paradox, <laughs> and uh, that's the rest of her body. She tends to get more red in the middle, and then she gets back to the pear. Oh, I hate it when this blurs out. Sorry, guys. Um, and then it gets back to the white again. And um, if I could just show you her belly, this stupid camera would allow me to. I hope you guys understand now why I don't like using HD videos. I do have another Sony camera. I can't find it at the moment. So um, if you guys can see, oops, doesn't really focus right. Sorry. One second. All right, here we go. Let's focus on that section there. And let's see if we could see her belly. You can kind of see on her belly over here on the bright side. There we go. There are orange, orange paradox spots on her belly, and that's how you know that it's a paradox snake. Hey, okay, I mean, that's about it. Ugh, blurry, um, but yeah, guys, <laughs> here you go. HD video, woo. Um, let's zoom it on the face.